It's all you can Vegas. Hey everybody, it's Derek and I'm here at Le Village Buffet at the Paris Las Vegas. Now we're here for the dinner buffet. It's $30.99 for dinner on the weekends and on the weekdays. It's only $5 more than lunch. So you might as well come for dinner. All right, let's see what there is to eat. This is cava tapi pasta with truffle cream. That certainly sounds French. Penne puttanesca, roasted carrots with bacon, eggplant caponata, and Leonese potatoes. And we're already at the seafood. This is bouillon base. That's a seafood stew. Fingerling potatoes, saffron, rice. The great thing about the Paris buffet is there's French food here. I mean, not all the casinos stick to their theme. You're not getting Egyptian food at the Luxor, but you are getting French food here. There's Brussels sprouts and carrots, pork bean cassoulet. I mean, you're, it may just look like a big bowl of beans to you, but trust me, it's French. Look at these poached pears. Mashed potatoes. Now, I wouldn't come to a Vegas buffet without mashed potatoes. Sweet potatoes, mushrooms, and rice pilaf. That's very French, I think. Maybe I'm just thinking of Edith Piaf. Well, that's Piaf, not Pilaf. Well, anyway, it. I. Here's the meat. It's prime rib, ready to be carved, just for you. I like to ask for a really big piece. Sure, small piece, huh? This lady's asking for a small piece. Now she's asking for another small piece. Now she's asking for another small piece. Why doesn't she just get a big piece? All right, here's some creamed spinach, pork au poivre, potato, scallop, scalloped potatoes. It's also French. All right, here's some more seafood. This is clams, sausage, and basil, mussels, and more clams, sausage, and basil, and butter. It's actually a lot of seafood here on this buffet. Got your peel and eat shrimp. If that's your thing. I'm not a big fan of cold shrimp. But you can get as much of it as you want you are a fan. What I'm a fan of is dessert. And let me just say, the Paris Buffet is, of course, a place to get dessert. This is bread pudding right here. Oh, but this is just the beginning. Because here's the crepe station. Now, there's crepe stations at other buffets. But this is the Paris Buffet. And you know, France is, well, they invented the crepe. And I don't know any other Vegas buffets where you can get prunes in your crepe, as well as vanilla sauce and caramel sauce, which you can here. They even have savory crepes. But we'll come back to this crepe station in just a bit. Let's check out the rest of the buffet. Here we have some olives and pickles. Tomatoes and cheese and some grilled vegetables. The French love their vegetables. I mean, they have vegetables with everything. Kind of like the way we like our, our Dorito chips here in America. And of course, there is pâté. I mean, it wouldn't be Paris without pâté. 
And it wouldn't be a Paris buffet without pate. You know, that's probably why I love buffets so much. Not only is there so much to eat, but there is some disgusting, gross food on some of these buffets. At least food I've never tried before and that I assume is disgusting and gross. You can eat the most disgusting, foul-looking piece of force meat that you have never ever thought about eating before and you can eat it here in Las Vegas look at all this butter that's a lot of butter do we need this much butter I guess we do because this is a French buffet and there's French onion soup Again, French buffet. If I have to stress anything about the Paris buffet, it is that it is truly a French food buffet. Now, let's take a look at the desserts. If there's anything that France should be proud of, it's desserts. Oh, and they are. Because why wouldn't they be? French desserts are some of the finest foods on this earth. And there is a crap ton of them here at the Paris Buffet. Like macarons. And of course, they says macaroons. Spell check. Macaroons are those coconut ones that like have, that look all jaggedy. Macarons are the nice little sandwichy ones. These are macaron pops. All sorts of colors, flavors decorations macarons are actually one of the awesomest desserts that exists and macaroons are actually one of the worst these are macarons and there is fresh fruit bananas apples oranges you know if the french like anything more than their fresh vegetables they like their fresh fruit I mean, they do have creme caramel. And they have all-you-can-eat crepes. Let's go back and check out the crepe station and see what we can order. I think I know what I want. Call me Caprese. Yes, could I get the, uh, the Caprese? Yes. Or Caprese. That's how you want to say it. Like macaroon. Look at that fine, fine crepery work she's doing with that crepe stick. This lady has made a few crepes in her day. Ooh, look at that. What? Wow. That's a nice flip. Almost perfect. Almost. But there's my cheese. Crazy is cheese, tomatoes, and basil. There's the tomatoes. So far, so good. Balsamic sauce that's got we could put more on there but that's okay she knows what she's doing she's a professional she gets paid by Caesars Corporation to make crepes she's a crepe mistress I thought she was done, but I thought maybe there's something missing. What's she adding? The mystery is killing me. What is she putting on my crepe? She's, she's perfecting it. It's, it's an art. She's perfecting her art because she knows how to make crepes. All types of crepes. She can make a sweet crepe. She can make a savory crepe. Thank you. 
she has made me this crepe. Look at that. That's pretty fancy looking. I like that. It's like micro greens. Like pea sprouts. I don't know if that belongs on a on a caprese or a caprese. Maybe it belongs on a caprese crepe. All right. I am ready to dig into this. So let's sit down and eat. All right. Let's cut into this caprese crepe and see how caprese it is. There's those tomatoes and the cheese. She's not really melted. Kind of looks just like the way she put it in. All right, so that wasn't that great, but I've got a plate full of meat and a pork and bean cassoulet. I got brisket, prime rib. The only thing that would make this better is if I had some seafood on here. And there's a lot of seafood on the buffet. Not a big fan of shellfish, but I am a fan of sushi. And sushi may not be French, but you know, it's international these days. The whole world loves sushi, and you can get sushi on every buffet in Las Vegas. Now that I take a good look at it, I don't think I'm going to get it on this buffet, but I will get some more meat. Because if there's anything that this buffet does well, it's the meat. And if there's anything that this buffet does better than meat, it's dessert. So my recommendation to you, when you come to the Paris Las Vegas Casino for your caprice crepes and macaroons, stick to the meat and the sweets. And how sweet it is. It's like I'm in Paris. There is creme caramel, macaron, tiramisu, chocolate cup, and carrot cake, and a macaron pop, and creme brulee. Maybe not all these desserts are French, but I certainly feel like I'm at a French bakery. And it's an all-you-can-eat French bakery, which is probably one of the greatest ideas ever. That's what you have here at the Paris Las Vegas Buffet. All-you-can-eat French pastries, which should be enough for anyone. But you also get all-you-can-eat French meat, French fruit, and French vegetables. And French potatoes, which I guess are French fries, which they don't actually have. Where's the French fries? Now maybe I just missed them because they're labeled pum frites. Hey, thanks for watching, everybody. Please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Leave a comment and let me know what you think about the Village Buffet. And be sure to subscribe for more because there's always more to eat when it's all you can Vegas.